Hi, good evening everyone. This is Fred here from Helium's Bricks and in today's video I'm going to be talking about the Lego sets that have all recently really retired. So for people who've been following my channel know that I do a lot of analysis and I track over 700 sets and a part of that is when tracking the duration of the sets, how long they've been active, when they started and when they finished. So we've just gone through all the list and updated everything that has been retired. So our sources are the Lego website and we also use a uh, brick set. So these are all the sets that have now kind of retired in the last month or two. So finally in the last quarter, so of December 2021. So there's 180 of them and that, because of that many, we're not going to be able to do this all in one video. So this is the part one where we're going to go around 60, 65 sets. Uh, we're going to highlight these sets that we uh, seen that are now retired. And this is quite important information if you're looking for uh, some sets from an investment perspective. Maybe you want to see if you can still snap them up quite quickly before they rapidly shoot up in price. A lot of these sets were already have shot up in price, even though at the time of this recording, we're only the 10th of January. So it's only been 10 days since these have been retired. And yeah, some of them have already gone up uh, quite considerably. So uh Make sure if you want want these to snap them up sooner rather than later. But yeah, let's get started and uh, let's go with the list. First, we have the roller coaster 10261, which was launched in June 2018 and it had a retail price of £300. Next, we've got the Jurassic Park T Rex Rampage set 75936, which was launched in July 2019 and had a retail price of £220. Then, We've got 76139, the 1989 Batmobile, which was launched in December 2019 and had a, re a recommended retail price of £220. Up next is Lego ID set Pirates of Barracuda Bay 21322, which was only launched in April 2020 and had a retail price of £180. Then we've got the A-Wing Starfighter 75275, the UCS one, which was launched in May 2020 and was also at £180. Then we've got the Upside Down Stranger Things 75810, launched on June 2019, and had an RRP also of £180. Up next, we've got Modular Building, the Corner Garage 10264, which was launched in January 2019, and had an RRP of £160. Then we've got another Creator Expert set, which is the James Bond Aston Martin DB5 10262, Launched in August 2018 and had a retail recommended retail price of £130. Then got Lego City 60266, the Ocean Exploration Ship, which was launched in June 2020 and had an RRP of £125. Then we got to Ninjago 71705, the Destiny's Bounty, also launched in June 2020 and also had a recommended retail price of £125. Then we've got uh, Lego City 60229, the Space Rocket Assembly and Transport, which was launched in June 2019 and had an RRP of £120. Then we've got a few Lego art sets. The first one, 31197, the Andy Warhol's Mar Marilyn Monroe, launched in July 2020 and was at £115. Then we've got 31198, the Beatles, also launched 3rd of July 2020 and had £115 recommended retail price. We also got 31199, the Marvel Studios Iron Man, also July 2020, and £115. And then finally, 31200, the Star Wars The Sith, also July 2020, and also RRP of £115. Then we move on to the creator expert, the London Bus 10258, launched in August 2017, and had an RRP of £110. Then we got the Marvel Avengers Helicarrier 76153, launched in June 2020 and just retired and had an RRP of £110. Then we got Star Wars Kylo Ren Shuttle 75256, launched in October 2019 and had an RRP of £100. We got the Creator Experts Crocodile Locomotive 10277, launched in July 2020 and had an RRP of £90. Then we got Lego Architecture 21046, the Empire State Building, uh, launched in June 2019 and had an RRP of £90. Then got Lego Friends uh, Summer Fun Water Park 41430, uh, launched in June 2020 and also RRP of £90. Then Lego Technic Mobile Crane 42108, launched in December 2019 with an RRP of £90. Also got the Lego Technic Concrete Mixer Truck 42112, which was launched in August 2020 and also had an RRP of £90. 
Then we move on to some LEGO City stats. First one, 60216, the Downtown Fire Brigade, launched in December 2018 uh, at 90 pounds. Then we've got 60228, the Deep Space Rocket and Launch Control, which was launched in June 2019, also had an RP of 90 pounds. And then we got 60258, the Tuning Workshop, launched in December 2019 and had an RRP of 90 pounds. Then we got Super Mario 71369 Bowser's Castle Boss Battle Expansion Set, launched in August 2020 and had an RRP of 90 pounds. Move on to Ninjago 71722, the Skull Sorcerer's Dra Dungeons, launched in June 2020 with an RRP of 90 pounds. Then we got Star Wars Poe Dameron's X Wing Fighter 75273, also launched at the end of December 2019 uh, for 90 pounds. Another Star Wars set, 75291, the Death Star's Final Duel, August 2020 launch date, with an RRP of £90. Then we got Jurassic World, 75941, the Indominus Rex vs Ankylosaurus, launched in June 2020, with an RRP of £90. Then we've got a seasonal set, so the Spring Lantern Festival Chinese New Year 1, 80107, launched in January 2021, for an RRP of £90. Then we got the Creator Expert Gingerbread House 10267 launched in October 2019 with an RRP of £85. Then we got 10269 the Harley Davidson Fat Boy launched in August 2019 also with an RRP of £85. Next we got Architecture 21045 the Trafalgar Square launched in June 2019 with an RRP of £80. Then we got one of the Batman 76160 the Mobile Bat Base. Uh, launched in uh, June 2020, also with an RRP of £80. Then we got Marvel Avengers Tower Battle 76166, launched in August 2020, uh, with an RRP of £80. Then we move to Creator 3 in 1, 31097, the Townhouse Pet Shop and Cafe, launched in June 2019, with an RRP of £75. Then we got Disney Arendelle's Castle, Vis Castle Village 41167. Launched in October 2019 with an RRP of £75. Then we got Lego Friends 41424, the Jungle Rescue Base, launched in June 2020 with an RRP of £75. Disney's Raya and the Heart Palace 43181, launched only in March 2021 uh, with an RRP of £75. Then we got Ninjago 71721, the Skull Sorcerer's Dragon, zero, uh, launched in June 2020 for an RRP of £75. Then we got Star Wars 75286. General Grievous Starfighter launched in August 2020, also RRP of £75. Then we got Marvel uh, Venomosaurus Ambush 76151, launched on June 2020 uh, with RRP of £75. Then we got Monkey Kid 80010 Demon Bull King, launched in May 2020 and uh, had an RRP of £75. Then we got the Lego IDs 92177 Ship in a Bottle, so the, the relaunch one was relaunched in January 2021 uh, with an RRP of £70. Then we got Disney 43172 Elsa's Magical Ice Palace, which was launched in August 2019 with an RRP of £65. Then we got the Ninjago Firestone Mech 71720, launched in June 2020 with an RRP of £65. Then we got Star Wars 75284, the Knights of Ren transport ship, launched in August 2020 with an RRP of £65. Then we got 80106, Story of Neon, launched in January 2021 for, um, with an RRP of £60. Then we got Lego Friends 41429, the Heart Lake City airplane, launched in June 2020 with an RRP of £60. And Lego City 60215 Fire Station launched in December 2018 with an RRP of £60. Then we've got Star Wars 75249, the Resistance Y-Wing Starfighter, launched in October 2019 with an RRP of £60. Then we've got Harry Potter 75953, Hogwarts Whomping Willow, launched in August 2018 with an RRP of £60. Next up is Architecture Dubai 21052, launched in January 2020, with an RRP of £55. Then we've got LEGO IDs 21320, the Dinosaur Fossils, launched in November 2019, also with RRP of £55. And then we've got LEGO Friends 41394, the Heart Lake City Hospital, which was launched in December 2019 with an RRP of £55. 
Next up is the Star Wars 75276 Stormtrooper helmet, launched in March 2020 with an RRP of £55. Then we've got Jurassic World 75940 Gallimimus and Pteranodon Breakout, launched in June 2020 with an RRP of £55. Up next, we've got a few Marvel sets. It's 76125 The Iron Man Hole of Armor, um, launched in April 2019 with an RRP of £55. Then we got 76152 Avengers Wrath of Loki, launched in June 2020, uh, also RRP of £55. Then we got the Iron Man Helmet 76165, launched in August 2020, with an RRP of £55. Then we got Speed Champion set 76899, the Lamborghini Urus STX and Lamborghini Huracan Super Trofeo Evo, launched in January 2020, with an RRP of £55. Up next, we've got two monkey kits. Uh, it's 8009, the Pixies food truck, uh, launched on uh, May 2020 with an RP of £55. And then finally, we've got 80015, the Monkey Kids Cloud Roadster, which was launched in August 2020 and also had an RRP of £55. So that's it for today's video. That's a, quite a long list. Uh, we will be creating another uh, list, probably another two lists with all of these, because I think there's around 180 plus sets that have retired. So we've done around 65 in today's video. So keep an eye out for the next video where we're going to be going through the next sets that have retired. Well, we hope you enjoyed this content. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.